Hi everyone, warm day out here in Georgia. Mark Halpern's a person you probably never heard of until today, because you probably have heard that he called President Obama a dick. Mark Halpern's the senior editor for Time Magazine and was a senior correspondent on Morning Joe and with MSNBC. Well, he was suspended today. Now, this, if you haven't seen it, but you've heard about it or read about it on the internet, is what happened. Mark Halpern, what was the president's strategy? We're, we're coming up on a deadline and uh, the president uh, decided to please his base, push back against the Republicans. I guess the question is, because we all know a deal has to be done, is this sort of showmanship? You know, a lot of times you go out there and both sides and they act tough so their base will be appeased and then they quietly work the deal behind the scenes. Are we, so, in, a, are we, it, are we in the seven second delays? Now wait, wait, time out. Mark knew that he was going to say something that was explosive. Keep, let's keep going. Okay. Oh, Lord. No, I wanted to characterize how I thought the president behaved. How do you think you Well, we have it. We can I mean, use it, right, Alex? Yeah, sure. Come on. Yeah. Take a Go chance. Go for it. Say. Yeah, let's see what happens. Just, you, 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 <laughs> Alex, I'm behind button. you. You fall down. I'm going to mm -hmm. catch you. It's, Trust and me. the precedent has been set on yeah. the okay, show. Okay, so ahead. we're good. I thought he was kind of a dick yesterday. Oh. Oh, my God. Delay that. <laughs> Delay that. What are you doing? I think the president... I can't, I can't believe you. I was joking. Don't do that. Did we delay that? I hit it. I hope it worked. Okay. Okay. Well, my mom's watching, so we'll know whether that worked or not. Hold on. Nope, I'm it holy check the technology. I gotta say, the, I'm the, not, the, I'm not the, shocked the, by much. I, that kind of shocked me. I, I mean, seriously, <sighs> you can't shock me. I just, I was just really <laughs> with you guys. I'd like to hear more of your analysis. <laughs> yeah. I'll, I'll clean it up. Okay. You know, I, I was when I say test it, I'm just joking because every time people fell back with me, Cap, I let them go and hit the grip. But go ahead. You catch me now, I'm falling. Okay. I think that the president was posturing, as you said, yeah. Yeah. to try to. What Republicans have on their side now is they think if this, if the deadline doesn't get met, that the president's going to get the blame. The economy will be in, in chaos, perhaps, but whatever is, the president will get the blame. Unlike in the showdown they had over the potential government shutdown. He went out yet. <laughs> I got to tell you something about Mark, Mark Halper and something that you probably don't know. Mark is not known for being a fan of President Obama. In 2008, he complained that the press coverage of Obama, or the press coverage of the presidential election and the Democratic primary was pro-Obama. And he was consistently making statements against Obama and... This was pointed out by a number of people involved with what was called then, and still is now called, the Obama Rapid Response Team, of which I have been a part for now something like six years. So, Mark Halpern has not been a fan of those of us who are supporters of President Obama. But I'm going to say something else. Mark Halpern would not have said that if Obama was white. He said that because he doesn't have respect for Obama because Obama is black. It would never have entered his mind to be so disrespectful to President Obama if President Obama were white. He knows it. You know it. A lot of you know it. And if you don't know it now, you need to know it. He has a pattern of this, he being Mark Halpern, going all the way back to quoting the Drudge Blogs, which is a right-wing you know, organ of links and information about conservative causes and a conservative, presenting a conservative slant. So Mark Halpern is not someone who has been supportive of Barack Obama and is probably pissed off as heck that Obama's there and he thought, well, I'm just going to make a blast against him and get the right wing straight up and say, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mark Halpern, piece of work. He, he's, okay, you say he apologized. Yeah, he knew what he was doing. He knew what the consequences would, would, would be. So, Mark Halpern, what Mark Halpern did, should not endear anyone who's an Obama fan to him. And Mark Halpern should always be thought of as someone who is against the Obama administration.